Hey, what's going on, everybody? Scott Dog Gaming here. Thank you very much for joining us. Let's see, we are playing The Witcher 3. It is eight minutes past seven at night, and we're about to head off on a journey to see if we can find Yennefer. So off we go. Where is my horse? We have much work to do here. The griffin's head, so we're going to take that with us. Wonder if we can sell it. Where are we going? We're heading this way. Let's go. Those people have been doing press ups for a long, long time. Definitely gonna come back and kill that thing in the Not your lucky day. Oh, that could have gone better. Shit. Go go kill the geezer with the crossbow or the archery. He's got his bow out again. See some chicken when I'm having a fight. That's what I like to see. Oh, what? I was blocking. God damn it. Oh, what a cock up. What a cock up. That could have gone better. Right, let's try this again. Oh my god. Ah. Ah. Okay. Let's get down the stairs. Come on, horsey, let's go. How bloody time you showed up, let's go. Come on, Roach.
Hmm, there is a dead man here. And a door I can't get in. Yes, yeah, a fishing rod. Okay. Let's try this again, shall we? Ow, oh, dodging didn't work then. Well, that block didn't go so well. Oh my god. Need some more chicken. Holy crap. if I caught my breath. I've eaten some bread, mate. What do you make of that? He does a grand job. Nice. He does a grand job of defending himself whilst he's on fire. I really need to practice fighting. <laughs> really, really need to practice fighting. We do love some loot. Interesting. Definitely looks like I should meditate first before I head down that little hole. Okay. There goes nothing. I'm guessing I used the wrong one. <laughs> Whoops.
Nice. Requires a key. Where do I find a key, I wonder? Well, that's a bit of a bonus. We found a lot of stuff down there. Oh, can't get out, mind. There we go. Any keys around here? Oh my god, what's going on? No, it wasn't having much of that. Okay, let's go. Wrong button. Yeah, I really need practice at this. Come on. Tell if you love the gods. Rape me lovers to work. Holy moly. His head just landed. I should prob probably stop eating raw meat. Um, my meditation went well. Let's meditate until eight. See if that's healed us up a bit. Ah, that's good. Okay. doing down there? Seriously, what are you doing, horse? Oh, come on. Uh, uh, I can't get on the... There we go. Right, we need to get somewhere so I can heal my horse. Horse, I can repair my sword. Um, go, go. Let's just head down the path, I guess. Sorry, mate. You're in the way. Told you. So we are in a new location. Those bloody shorts again. What is wrong with you? Put some trousers on. So this is the same place we started in. We need to go in here, but I'm tempted actually just to run up this way a little bit first. Keep an eye on the griffin head, Roach. Right. Oh, you know what I needed to do? I'll be back. So what have we got going on in the whole inventory front?
Okay, so we got some new trousers. What does our current sword do? 25 to 31 damage. Is that right? Oh no, 26 to 32 damage. For the sake of repairing it, I might as well just equip one of these slightly worse ones, I would suggest. Although... Customer, welcome. What can I do for you this time? Show me what you got. Okay. So we might as well. Can we sell some of these? Looks like we can. Well, that one's the dead one. We might as well keep hold of that for now. Sell that. Oh. Can't sell any junk here, and we've got a lot of it. Right, we could get him to make something for us. Um, no, we can't. As we're going to repair everything while we're here, I suppose. I can disband quite a lot of stuff. Disband? That's not the right word. Um, you can dismantle wolf hide. Well, let's do this, I suppose. It teaches something when it horse hide. Probably don't want to do that. Do this. We'll get some twine from this. What is the mouse doing? Go away. And I guess we'll keep hold of everything else until we know what we need to do with it, I suppose. Okay, thanks, little man. Oh, like you to forge something for me. Let's just come out of there completely. That's not what I meant to do. Farewell, my friend. So long. Right, so we can now equip our better sword again. Lovely. And off we go. Well done, Roach. Come to Pappy. Well, those two again. A lot of bandits in here today. I'll rip off your melon and shit down your neck. I'm not convinced you will, mate. Yennefer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so something wrong. Look around. Trouble brewing. Who are they? Patriots, drinking their seventh round for Tamaria, fists starting to itch. Don't see any enough guardians. They'll find another foe. I'll buy some provisions for the journey, then we'll go. Geralt, we should stay out of it, just this once. Hmm, doesn't sound ideal, does it? To the lilies. Took them down. Took them down to hang a golden sun there now. I cannot show Temerian colours. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fond of the Imperials? You Nilfgaard's whore! 
Don't let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit. They hang my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to Let's my sister attending to the birth. And you don't fear the gods' wrath. You don't fear it, you cunt! Nice. Leave me be! Recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? They say witches steal young'uns. That's true. What the Emperor promised you, freaks? Your own land, like he did the elves once. Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. Oh, God. Neither are you. They won't back down now. I can see that. What the fuck? <laughs> Cut a lot of people's heads off. It's all right. It's over. Leave me be. Get away. See his face. God save us. Be gone. And don't ever come back. <laughs> so much for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. Well, that went well. That brawl, we didn't start it. Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. Y Yen? How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Well, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. Wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? He didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you. But I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it. In Vizima. Ready your horses. We can talk here. Some charming orchards nearby. In bloom even, so you almost can't smell the corpses. A tempting proposition. Sadly, I must say no. You see, someone awaits you in Vizima. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or, to those on more intimate terms with him, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Doubt I number among that group. For as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse? I didn't, though I could have. Fine. Guess I'm willing to hear him out. The Emperor of Nilfgaard, Lord of Metina, Ebbing, and Gamera, Sovereign of Nazare and Vicovaro, will feel honored, I'm sure. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Kaer Morhen, remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Fezimir. See you soon. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. 
Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. Well, off we go. You know, I had a dream about you recently. Knowing you, it was probably filthy. Just the beginning, but then... But then... Uh... Right now! Uh -oh. tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seemed just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. I did learn that, he's right. It must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to his Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the berger. The what now? In that uh, chair. <laughs> Tetwin. Please shave the gentleman's sideburns to half an inch. What's wrong with my beard? Always thought it added to my dignity. It does. Yet it also detracts from your elegance. In Nilfgaard, we consider beards hard on the eyes. Especially beards infested with lice. Been on the road a while. Fine, do your thing. Tilt your head back, please, and sit still. My beard. How goes it? Preparations for the audience proceeding as planned. Yes, General. The gentleman will be more or less presentable. Who's this guy? He a barber too? No. Morvran Vorius, commander of the Alba division. Yennefer's escort. They were my men, all of them. Indeed, were, for none have returned to Vizima, have they? I truly wonder what happened on the road yesterday. Perhaps you could enlighten me. You have time, 
And, uh, razor to your throat. Your men died in battle, as soldiers tend to. I see their fate does not trouble you, overly. True, but I'm guessing the fate of those whose country they invaded didn't overly trouble them. Nordlings, we can bathe you, shave you, and clothe you, but teaching you manners, that will be a challenge. Nice meeting you too. Done. Shall I shave him once more, against the grain? No. He himself is very much against the grain, that's enough. Farewell, Witcher. Or rather, see you soon. Oh, my beard. Now the gentleman may dress. My beard. Why would you do such a thing? Sadly, I did not receive exact measurements. If the garments chafe, our tailor will adjust them. Black, black, or black. We do not like garish colors in Nilfgaard. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. Hmm. Aren't they all the same? Let's go with this one, why not? I mean, that one looks like a... Can I pick different trousers? No. I'm going to pick something from each one. <laughs> why not? I think they're all the same. This might come as news to the gentleman, but the towel wrapped around one's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. The gentleman will kindly dress. <sighs> Have you not got someone who can do that for me? What about now? No? Okay. Kept a towel. Keeping your towel, it's like a hotel. And they say clothes do not make the man. Does the outfit satisfy the gentleman? A studded doublet and a sword on my back, that's what would satisfy me. But tough, when in Nilfgaard. Yes. It's a saying. So what now? Powder my nose? No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. Confirm away. Please watch. Leg extended. Hand flat. Head down. Chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. I wasn't really listening. Hmm, lacking fluidity and grace. But we've learned to expect less of Nordlings. Come with me. Great. Well, that went well. And I think with that being the case, at the end of the episode there thank you very much for watching please the gentleman will address the emperor only when asked to and using the appropriate title sure your arch magnificency i see the gentleman is in the mood for jests i fear the emperor might not share his disposition your majesty was beard advice. spoken loudly clearly and with respect my poor beard anyway uh let's call it the end of the episode there thank you very much for watching please hit the like button subscribe button follow us on twitter at gaming see you again soon thank you